When Raman data are collected in to individual files, these files in an ASCII format need to be collected into a directory containing files all of a similar format. So if I look at what this format is, I've got a wave number and an intensity, and then I've got two columns of wave number and intensity. These are irregularly spaced abscissa, that's to say that the step between each one of these abscissa values are not uniform. So if I have a directory that contains a set of equivalent files all having a single header and irregular spaced abscissa values for the intensities, then I can collect these into a VAMAS file and I can do this by entering a file name and this is the VAMAS file name that will be generated and then I give it the IRF filter so that's irregular file filter and I need to say that we've got Raman and I need to say we've got one header line so I'll say minus skip one and when I press open all of these files will be processed and the data collected into a new VAMAS file. So here we see the new VAMAS file. These are the VAMAS blocks containing the spectra and each one is assigned a data set index and the sample identifier will similarly be set to the file name that was used to collect the data.